Pioneer Field Agronomist Joe Eltz coming to you from Polk County, Wisconsin. And today I want to take a moment to talk about how exceptional corn canopy health may translate to increased test weights this fall. Throughout the entire 2019 season, despite the late planting, we have had low disease pressure across the area, resulting in these incredibly healthy canopies. Don't see a whole lot of northern corn leaf blight, rust was minimal, and some of the other diseases that normally would affect the corn canopy simply have not been present in the 2019 growing season. As a result of that, we have these exceptionally healthy crop canopies as we're coming in to the finish line this season. And we're seeing oftentimes that these kernels are not denting to the degree that they would based on normal averages. And you see here, some of these rows are just not showing the profound denting that you would normally otherwise see. So what's going on here? Begs that question. Well, we know that the guys who are swinging for the fences in the NCGA contest try to finish their corn without any denting at all, as a fuller corner results in more starch, more starch makes more yield, as well as more weight. So I suspect what's happening here is that the upper canopy health is allowing the plant to manufacture more starch, more sugars that is going into the ear, resulting in less kernel denting, potentially setting us up for above average test weights in the 2019 growing season. From Polk County, Wisconsin, thanks for watching. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.